We're back with our guests Katie and MC who are now going to demonstrate some exercises for us as promised. Thanks All ladies. Right. Thank you for joining me with this. Okay, we're going to start with some warm up for our wrists. So we're going to bring our hands up at about chest height and we're going to do a wrist circle. Good. Make that circle as big as you can. And now ready, let's go the opposite direction. Big circle, warming up those wrists. And this is something you can do just sitting in a chair while you're watching TV. Now we're going to do a fist and fling. We're going to make a fist, we're going to fling, and a fist and a fling. We are stretching all those small muscles in our fingers. Let's try one more. And ready, we're going to shake those hands down right there by our lap. Now let's go into shoulder shrugs. We're going to take our shoulders up to our ears, all the way up and lower down. And shoulders up to our ears and lower down. Let's do two more, just like that. Shoulders up to the ears. Now ready, shoulders forward. We're going to stretch our back. Now open those shoulders out to the side, stretching the chest. And again, shoulders forward and back. And again, forward and back. Let's do one more here, forward and back. Good, rolling our shoulders back, working on those joints, getting that range of motion for our shoulders. Big circle back. Let's do two more here. And the last one. Now going into our neck, we're going to take our right ear to our right shoulder and we're going to let this left hand gently reach down towards the floor and you feel a nice stretch here through your neck. Now ideally we'd like to hold these stretches for about 20 seconds. And now we're just going to switch sides. Left ear to left shoulder, letting that right hand reach down towards the floor for a deeper stretch. Coming back to center, let's take our chin and we're going to look over our right shoulder. And this is again stretching the neck Pretend you're in your car and you're looking behind you. You want to see what's going on. We come back to center and we'll look opposite direction. And back to center. Let's move on to our legs. We're going to take our right knee and we're going to lift this right knee up to the chest. And go ahead and use your hands to hold that knee up to the chest. Let's point and flex our foot. And now we're going to circle that ankle around a big circle, opposite direction. And now placing this right foot on our left leg. Now I do want to show a modification. If this bothers you to get your leg up this high, just cross at the ankles. But this is a great stretch for the hip as we gently push the knee out to the side. And now we're going to cross this right knee on our left. And I want you to use that left hand, place it on the opposite knee, and look behind you. Good, this is a great spinal stretch here. Come back to center and bring the knee up and lower. Let's try that on the opposite side. Left knee comes up, we point and flex the foot. And we're going to circle that ankle around. Opposite direction, again, big circle, as big as you can. Now going into that hip stretch, we're going to place our foot on that bent knee. And again, you can always cross at the ankles if that feels more comfortable. So we're gently pushing the knee out to the side as we're sitting tall. Feel the stretch through the hip. And now we're going to cross at the knees. Opposite hand on the knee, and again, look behind. And this one we like to say, again, we're in our car and we're backing up, we wanna look behind us and release. Let's uncross those legs. Let's move on to this right knee again. We're going to lift the knee up and down to the chest. Up and down. Now this is hard for you. You can always use your hands as an assist and pull that knee up to the chest. Let's do one more. Now slight change. We're going to step up and out of our car. Get that knee out to the side, back to center. Out to the side, back. Let's try two more like that. Good. And back to center, let's go opposite side. Bring that knee up to the chest and lower. Again, we wanna be sitting tall as we're doing these exercises, so think about having good posture. That chest is lifted. Now let's go out of our car. Bring that knee up and out and back to center. So again, these are all exercises you can do at home just with a chair. Good. One more, right back to center. Now let's go ahead and bring our hands up at the chest. Pretend we have a heavy box and we're going to push this box up onto a shelf and back and push. Now here's where you could get um, a hand weight or even as we mentioned before, a soup can and you can pretend or you can practice pushing. Now let's try at an angle. Let's go to the right corner, twist using that waist. Let's go to the left corner, twist. 
one more each direction lift back to center and lift back to center hands come to our side now we're going to practice uh, some leg work to strengthen those legs we're doing a sit to stand so if you need to use your chairs a little support we're going to stand up and make sure you know your chair's right behind you and we're going to sit down. Now a couple things to keep in mind. Make sure those knees stay over the ankles or your shoelaces. We just don't want those knees coming over too far. As we stand up, we reach and we come down. And we stand up. Now I want to show a modification. If this is bothering you to stand all the way up, you can always just try just a few inches up out of your chair and back down. A few inches up and back down. So you don't have to stand all the way up if that's not comfortable for you. And one more right back in the chair. Again, let's roll those shoulders back as we are sitting tall. We're going to bring our right knee up to the chest again. This time we're going to extend that leg out. Heel down, toe is up. Now I want you to think about leading with the chest as you gently hinge forward. And this is going to stretch the back of our leg. Good. Again, ideally we'd like to hold these stretches for about 20 seconds. We're going to round the back as we come into center. Let's try opposite side. We're bringing the knee up to the chest. We extend the leg out, heel down, toes up, and lead with the chest as we gently hold that stretch. And release. Let's take in a deep breath. We're going to inhale as we reach those arms up. We're going to exhale, good. And again, inhale up, exhale. And let's try one more big breath in through the nose and out through the mouth. When we are done. Great, thank you ladies for joining us. We really appreciate it. So that's our show this week. Thanks so much for joining us. We hope you'll do some of these exercises or find other ways that you can get active and improve your health. Until next week, stay fit, stay well, and stay healthy for life with Healthy Living for Life. Healthy Living for Life is brought to you by Mountain Pacific Quality Health. We'd love to hear from you. If you have suggestions for future programs, visit our website at mpqhf.org or call us at 406-443-4020. You can also catch us on YouTube by visiting our website and clicking on the YouTube icon. Special thanks to Fire Tower Coffee House and Roasters. Production facilities provided by Video Express Productions.